Hello everyone, in this video let's see how to verify tooltip in Playwright. So to practice you can visit autoprac.com forward slash selenium and then tooltip. Here you will see tooltip example. Once you will mouse over on your age input box you will see we ask for your age only for testing tooltip. So a tooltip refers to a message that is displayed when a user hovers their mouse over an element such as an icon, image, button, text box, hyperlink or any other similar element on a web page or application interface. So the moment you will try to inspect tooltip elements, the tooltip and associated element in the document object model can disappear so to access these element navigate to chrome source tab in the developer tools then here you will see a pause button you can check the shortcut for mac it's f8 and command backslash for window it will be control backslash now hover the mouse over the element to display the tooltip now press f8 or any other shortcut you can see we are in debugging mode now use your cursor and inspect this time it will not disappear so you can see upon inspection a div element will be visible in the code representing the tooltip box this one div with class ui dash tooltip dash content so we have three steps to verify the tooltip using the tooltip box first one is over the mouse over the age input box then locate the tooltip div the box and extract the text content of the tooltip then third one is verify the content of the tooltip against the expected value so inspect this input box this is input with id h input hash h or you can directly use hash age so await page dot locator locate the input box and then hover for that we have hover function now after the mouse over locate the tooltip div inspect this div and here div with this class copy it so to store declare a variable await page dot locator then your selector and to get the content of this div use text content now we have content here in tooltip text variable let's verify it expect your variable then to be and our expected value which is this one we ask for your age only for testing copy it okay we are done now let's verify so we identified the input box 
then with hover command we got the text and stored in a variable and our test passed there is another way to verify the tooltip using the title attribute so in addition to appearing in tooltip div the tooltip text may also be displayed in the title attribute of the age input box so you can see once i inspect a title is generated now notice here till the time my mouse is over the input box title attribute does not contain value we ask for your age only for testing and the moment i move the mouse the value is generated in title you can see it now now when i mouse over on the input box title is blank title does not have equal to and the value and the moment i move the mouse we got the value so we would require an additional step here to move the mouse before verifying so now let's verify the tooltip using the title attribute so now we have four steps step 1 is over the mouse over the age input box which we can copy from our existing test and second step is move the mouse so to move the mouse you can use page dot mouse dot move move it to zero zero then third is extract the value of the title attribute so we need title text of this input the age input and to get the attribute we use get attribute title and then after getting the title we can verify it so copy this step step 3 of our existing test paste here and replace it with title txt now let's verify so let me comment this move the mouse step so that we can see the difference so you can see we got the error and in report you can see we are expecting we ask for your age and received value is blank why that's because we are not moving our mouse so this additional step is required now let's see so this time you can see one passed so these are the two ways of verifying the tooltip thank you for watching this video